usually think of this as somewhat secondary because it's not near as much fun as uh, building the bots to run the courses. And we assess then those presentations in terms of the ability for a team to communicate. Then also the ability to define a problem clearly. Both of those are skills that take some development, that take some discipline. Uh, so it's, I think it's probably one of the more difficult things as part of, that's part of the Mindstorm experience. They are very relieved uh, when they finish their presentation, whenever they complete a course, and they uh, jump up and down and give each other high fives and everything. Start. Start. How, how much is it? And it's more of a whew, whenever they complete uh, a presentation. But I think it's all part of the, the learning uh, how to solve problems together in a team. Okay. They put together notebooks that describe their processes. That also then provides them the foundations for making their presentation. They can look back through their old experience and, Talking about at some point. and they can say, you know, this is, this is a, an exam, a point in which we really used our teamwork to come up with a unique and interesting solution. So this is just the part of life. This is the way you get things done as you work as a team. Each of us has different skills and we learn how to apply those to a very difficult problem that none of us by ourselves 